Hello everyone, T-Man978. I'm hunting for retro 6-inch Marvel Legends, but here's something I never thought I would be having to talk about on my channel. I'm now an Amazon influencer. What that means is I get my own little storefront where I can host a bunch of products that I collect or things that I'm interested in. And if you guys click the link, which is going to be in the description to all my ongoing future videos, and you click on a product that I have hosted and you decide you want to buy it, then that means that will help out my channel. So give the link in my description a look and decide on if you want to buy anything. Thank you. I appreciate it. This Bumblebee helmet is 40 bucks. Oh man, look at this. <laughs> That's all the Transformers. It's not looking like they'd finished the reset yet. A sniper shot. Woo! Yeah. So, well, let me push pause and dig through them toys they're messing with. I already saw that guy. Yeah. Luckily, there is nothing down there that I want. It's the only things that I have already. But <laughs> let me walk around because apparently I don't have no other choice. But um, pay attention to what's on clearance and what's not. I'm guessing they're moving Star Wars to where and Power Rangers to where the Marvel Legends used to be. So man, I guess I'm gonna have to come back here next week or. I, I seriously doubt I'm going to be down here tomorrow. This is near my job, and I don't work extremely close to my job. This target is a, a bit of a trip. Hey, these My Little Pony things, whatever the heck they are. Cutie Mark crew, my plants. So I'm guessing I missed all the good stuff, but... I'll turn the camera on if I find something. Here's definitely something. These $10 Ninja Turtles. Well, they used to be $20, but for $10, they are well worth that. I haven't played with them myself, but just looking at the articulation that I can see, I'm willing to bet this isn't supposed to be over here. People are always doing things. Somebody probably scanned it and decided they didn't want to pay $50 or $52. Goldberg. That is not a big discount. $22 and change? Nah. Oh, maybe that turtle set is supposed to be over here? Let me scan it. I can confirm that this is regular price, $52. For the people that didn't know, they're coming out with a new Nintendo Switch, not the Nintendo Switch Lite, but the regular Nintendo Switch is going to be in an all red box. If you see the all red box, that means it has a bigger battery life and probably, I think it might be a little bit faster or something, but definitely bigger battery life. They haven't been advertising that. I guess they want the hype to be up for a Nintendo Switch Lite, but I don't know. It's going to have a bigger battery life than a Nintendo Switch Lite, so I will hold out and get that, to be honest. Hey, look at this. This looks like the opposable statue, though. Well, only thing looks supposable is the waist and the arms. Super Saiyan Blue. Cool. Well, Vegeta, sorry. Doesn't look anywhere near as good as the SH regulars. Real quick in Barnes and Noble. Um, they suck as far as getting new 
SH Figure Works besides Dragon Ball, but they get a steady supply of model kits and whatnot. So, yeah. Only thing over there is the usual assortment of Dragon Ball Z, or Dragon Ball Super. I might as well just say Dragon Ball. And this is 50 bucks, yikes. It's more than a Thundercracker down there. Okay, as some of my hardcore followers already know, I'm a part of a podcast called Figure Action. We go live every Thursday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. And one of the main hosts on there, Extra Zero, he invited us to his house, the cast of Figure Action, to his house this weekend. So we can see his collection and just just talk with each other and eat over his house and whatnot. It was fun. Um, I might be showing footage of some of the stuff, some of the stuff that I'm not going to use in any other video. But anyhow, while I was there, I acquired these two figures from him. Takara Legends Nightbird right here. I guess her, um, her official name is Nightbird Shadow. But in the G1 cartoon, she was just Nightbird. And I also acquired Takar Legend's Slipstream right here. And yes, she's just Slipstream. It's 16 and 15. I've been wanting these two for a while. The third one was Black Arachnia. He did offer me her, but I'm going to hold off until the masterpiece comes up. But I'm super happy to own these finally. I really have been wanting Slipstream because... I think this is or was one of the first representations of her in figure form where she actually has a good robot move, which is awesome. From Parts Former, I was able to pick this up. He found this at Target at a really reduced price. Unfortunately, he says it's not that great of a figure because he bought one for himself, but I'll open it. Mega Man or whoever can blow him around or knock him around. It's Airman from the Mega Man Fully Charged cartoon if you didn't read that. Outside of that, Joe brought something for me to see because I wanted to see it and he allowed me to bring it home so I can review it and not be stressed over there trying to film it. <laughs> but anyway, it's the Mezco Joker right here. You may have seen videos on it. I know Plastic Addict just recently did a review. I've messed with them already a little bit. I like it. So, I plan to film that at some point this week. But also, from Amazon, and like I was saying earlier in this video, there's going to be a link in the description to my Amazon storefront. But, um... Uh, here are some pre-orders that I got. I mentioned this in another video that I was getting these. I don't remember if it was this video. I don't think it was this video. But firstly, they packed a lot of stuff in here. Transformer Siege Thundercracker. He has a lot of crap, a lot of silver paint on his leg. And he has the smirk. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that, if it's going to focus on that. Can you see it? Let me know. But also, they gave me Marvel Legends Retro 6-inch Dazzler here. Isn't she lovely? Now, one of the figures that I pre-ordered, I rather got that instead of Dazzler. I wish they would have held this one back, but she looks cool. I didn't even look at it. Yeah, I like her hands and her face. This is what she looked like in the X-Men arcade game. And I've been really excited about this one. Wendigo Build-A-Figure Wave, Mr. Sinister. I was helping a friend, like move, well, I didn't help them move. I went over to the house after the move had already 
commenced. And I seen the Toys Biz version of this guy just laying on the ground. Like, I was like, well, what the heck? It was covered in dirt. I don't know if I put that footage anywhere, but man, he looks nice. And this box is heavy. Probably because of this big Wendigo arm. But, um, I don't know if I'm going to complete this wave. I wanted him, Nightcrawler, and I guess Boom Boom. I don't know anything about Boom Boom. But I have no interest in the Guardian. Cannonball doesn't even have legs. And this X-Force Wolverine I don't care about. And I'm not too pressed about when to go, to be honest. So, yeah, I don't know if I'm going to be going to be collecting the whole wave. But lastly, and this is the one I'm most, most excited about. I'm happy that they decided to give me this and not make me wait till Monday. And look, you see the bag they put it in. But it's retro, Marvel Legends retro storm right here. Right after I turn this video off, I'm going to open this. So she's not going to be inside of this packaging when I do the review. Spoiler alert. Here is this image right here. Maybe I can take a, a screenshot of this and show people in the next video. But yeah, here is the back right there. And this is this. I don't know if you can read the bio. I hope that is coming in clear because... On the screen I'm looking at, it's sideways. Samsung. Samsung is messing up. When they upgraded us to Android Pie, like, this camera is great quality. If you've, if you've been watching my reviews, hopefully you can agree. But when they updated to Android Pie, Pie they took, a bunch, of way, they took a, a bunch of the features away and made it like an iPhone. If I wanted an iPhone, I would have gotten an iPhone. It's like, Why? iPhone has been chasing Android for years. Why would you downgrade an Android and all the features that we get to make it like iPhone? That is ridiculous. And it's a good thing that I didn't want to put this package to be in good condition because it has smashed the crap. Yeah, th this would not be collector's grade at all. This is something you'll see at a freaking convention and it, they'll still have 40 bucks, a 40 bucks sticker right there. But to recap, got these two ladies. Got Mr. Sinister. I'm gonna review this. Unfortunately, Joe isn't gonna let me have it. <laughs> Seeds Thundercracker, right here. Takara Legends Slipstream and Nightbird, right here. And lastly, this Mega Man fully charged Air Man. But anyhow, expect me to be talking about these later in the week. And I'm just noticing on this storm, I don't know how well it's going to come out, but on her left boob, there appears to be like a dent in it. Uh, I don't know if that's an ongoing thing. I severely doubt that that's an ongoing thing. I don't know if you can actually see it right there but uh, I'll see what that is when, when I open this uh, I, I doubt it's an optical illusion but anywho thank you all for watching this until next time T-Man978 oh I did a, col uh, a collection video of, at Extra Zero's house so stay tuned for that that's more than likely going to be my next video he has a massive collection of Transformers Masterpiece and a few other figures that aren't Transformer related, but mostly, if you love Transformers, he has a humongous Transformer Masterpiece collection. It is like, it's awesome, and it's a sight to behold. So, stay tuned for that. Thank you all for watching this. Until next time, T-Man978, out of here. And, uh, he's really yeah, Joe is fucking up. Was that Spelling shit on no. Zero's carpet. Yeah, he saw that there is a, a bit of an ab crunch there, but this one, yeah, this it, one, it spit up all over the carpet. Nice. You'll learn. Click, click the videos. Click the fucking videos, baby. Click, click the videos. You should really click these videos. Click.
click the videos, click those in the videos, baby. Click, click the videos. You really should click those videos. Click that shit.